Hey guys, welcome to another Adobe Photoshop tutorial. And today I'll be telling you how to create a comment in Adobe Photoshop. And as you can see right here, I've created a comment over here. So yeah, let's begin. So first of all, um, I'm using this background for the comment. And if you want this background, I'll just give you the link in the description. Um, yeah. So first of all, create a new layer and go to ellip elliptical marquee tool. Then press shift and make a small yeah make a small circle like that. And then just go to the bucket tool. Yeah, just go to the bucket tool and just click on it and the paint should be white and then what you do is um, okay, click on click on the elliptical marquee tool then go to filter blur Gaussian blur and make the radius into 2.1 or something 2.5 any pixel you want then deselect it by, contr by sh control or command D now as you can see the blurry on the circle so next up is the line at the comet um, so what you do is yeah um, go to smudge tool and and like you know you see the size if the uh, circle fits at the uh, comet so just like no put this size above here and yeah that's about it and make sure your strength is like above 90 percent and then what you do is like put put your circle here select it and hold shift to make a straight line and yep that's it as you can see um, now what you do is um, create a new layer and go to the bucket tool and make the foreground into black and just you know paint it then what you do is um, go to filter um, render and lens flare then make sure your brightness is into 100% and and the and just take the movie prime and just move it till the middle at at the picture and just press ok now you see this small circle over there and now go here and make the image um, make the image liner dodge add then pick the move tool and drag it to the face of the comet uh, that's it now go to the eraser tool and just rub that the blue line just rub it uh, yeah and rub this part also okay um, now what you do is um, yeah go to layer 1 and click on the layer mask tool then what you do is um, go to the gradient tool and go go over there and choose foreground to transparent just choose that and and then press ok now what you do is like go over here and press shift on it and then oh uh, yeah sorry make make the mode normal and make the opacity into 93 or any other you want then like you know go over here and press shift and like you know make this a bit invisible so yeah that's about it um then what else oh yeah uh click on the new layer 
and then go to gradient the same thing now make the opacity to 8 or something now what you do is just you know click on here make the small line oh oops one more mistake <laughs> click the mode and click on dissolve and now <laughs> you make a line over here make the foreground color to white sorry guys I'm making some mistakes um, then what you do is again like you know make that and now you see some sparkles at the image now you just move the image and move the sparkles at the face of the comet now what you do is um, go to edit go to transform and click on warp and now you see the upper left uh, box just like you know drag that at the let's drag it over here and the down left one over here and just move this box a bit like that and this box a bit over here and move this just squeeze it in squeeze the upper one in also and just click on the tick tick box and now as you can see the sparkle over here now this is the final step guys um just like you know click here and go to screen then go to blending options just right click on the layer 3 and click on blending options and you now just go to outer glow and go to click on normal and click on here and make this white and one more thing just you know go to the layer 1 and just we'll make the color of it sorry guys I had to do this at the first part but I forgot about it and I just remember at the last part um, so yeah just go to blending options and go to outer glow and choose that as hard light and make this pink just make that pink as you can see over here and click on inner shadow also make this um, also hard light and put this here make it a bit light over here like that yep and now as you can see or yeah just make the opacity up wait um let me do it as dodge no never mind just make that hard light and yeah that's about it guys so as you can see a comet like going through the space so yeah thank you for watching this video and hope you liked it and if you like this video please subscribe on my channel and if you have any problems you can comment on my video or in my channel so yeah thank you for watching and have a great day